so much to learn about. It'll make you want to shout, Mika! So much to learn about. It'll make you want to shout, Blippi! Whoa! Hey, it's me, Blippi! Whoa! And look at where we're at! Yeah, today we're at Aquarium of Boise in Boise, Idaho. And this place is awesome. Yeah, it's an aquarium. Have you ever been to an aquarium before? Yeah, it's so cool because they have so many marine animals here. Yeah, marine animals are animals that live in the water. Well, shall we go explore? Let's go. Whoa. Oh, there's so many different kinds of fish in here. Whoa, they're all back there. Oh, hello. <laughs> Whoa, look up here. Looks like a list of different types of fish. Oh, look at that one. That one's called a yellow tang. Yeah, and it's all yellow. <laughs> I wonder why it's called yellow tang. <laughs> Ooh, and look at this one. It says purple tang. Ooh, looks like it's purple and yellow. Whoa, Ooh, and that one way over there. Whoa, powder blue tang. Wow. Yeah, it's blue and yellow. Okay, let's try and find them. Um, let's find the yellow tang. <laughs> yeah, they're pretty distinct looking, huh? All yellow. Okay, not that one. <gasps> Wait, there's one way over there. Do you see it? It's so far back there. Oh, it's hiding. Hello, yellow tang. <laughs> Look up there. Yeah, an orange, white, and black fish. <gasps> I know what that is. Look up here. Yeah. That's the fish. It's a clownfish. Look up there. Do you see that blue fish? Yeah, it's just pure blue. It's really bright and vibrant. And look up here. Whoa, it's a blue damselfish. It's so bright and blue and colorful. Cool. See you later, fish. <laughs> Whoa, more fish. <laughs> Whoa. Look at this in here. Wait a second. This looks like the same shape as the last clownfish, but this one is just black and white. Yeah, do you see it right there? Yeah, a black and white striped fish. Here comes another one. Wait, yeah, this is actually a type of clownfish. Yeah, but can you think of an animal that lives on land that's black and white stripes? Yeah, a zebra. Wow, cool. These are the zebras of the ocean. <laughs> see you later, clownfish. Whoa, did you see that? Yeah, that looked like a puffer fish to me. Whoa, actually, it's a porcupine puffer. Yeah, looks really smooth right now. But if it gets frightened or scared or angry, what it does is its cheeks puff out and its whole body, yeah, becomes spiky. Yeah, it's a defense mechanism. Super cool. <laughs> Whoa, and look down here. Whoa, do you see this? Wow, looks like an eel. Yeah, this is actually a yellowhead moray eel. And it's just hanging out in the rocks. Yeah, just chilling. Yeah, that's what eels like to do. Hang out in the rocks and just poke their heads out. <laughs> All right, see you later. Fun hanging out with you. <laughs> Whoa, what else do they have here? <laughs> Whoa, look at this. Looks like an old boat that then water got into and rocks over the years. Whoa, it's a perfect fish habitat. Oh, and look at what I have. <laughs> yeah, some snacks for the fish. Yeah, just like how you and I like snacks. Yeah, fish like snacks too. Oh, and they said I can actually feed these fish. All right, first, let's try these peas. There we go. <laughs> All right, pour it in my hand. And then we'll see if the fish like to come and eat some food. Here you go. Whoa, do you see all those fish? Yeah, those are Japanese koi fish. There's so many of them and they're so colorful. All right, we have a little bit more food over here. All right, hello, Japanese koi fish. Yeah. All right, here you go. Whoa, are you hungry? Oh, they're so 
cool looking. They're so colorful. Yeah, some are orange and black, some are white and black, and some are white, black, and orange. <laughs> See you later. <laughs> All right, what else is around here? Whoa, look at this tank. This tank is massive. Looks like the fish are all on the other side. Oh, but there's a lot of gallons and liters of water in here. Oh, oh, and look at this. Whoa, looks like a scuba diver. Whoa, do you see this helmet? It looks like a port right here. Yeah, scuba divers have this area so then they can see while they're underwater. Oh, and scuba divers wear this outfit so then they can stay warm under the water and so they can breathe underwater. You know how you and I have to hold our breath underwater? Scuba divers can breathe while they're underwater. Cool. Oh, and do you see this big weight? Yeah. Us humans, we tend to float. So this weight is holding the scuba diver on the bottom of the seafloor. So then this scuba diver can work. Yeah, looks like the scuba diver works underwater. Wow! Whoa, look at all these tanks! Whoa, this is so cool! Whoa, and look at this one! It's really big and bright and vibrant. Yeah! Do you see that? Yeah, that orange thing? That is actually a sea anemone. Whoa, and do you see those rock looking things up there? Yeah, they're also pretty bright. Those are coral. Yeah, sea anemones and coral. Yeah, they're actually animals. They kind of just look like rocks, huh? Those coral do? <laughs> well, hey, do you see how bright they are and just vibrant in color? Yeah, it's actually because there's algae that lives inside the sea anemone. <laughs> Isn't that interesting? Whoa, oh look. You see how that fish is just hanging out with that sea anemone and right next to all that coral? Yeah. Coral is actually really, really important because a bunch of fish like these ones actually live in all the coral. Yeah, it's just like how you and I live in a house. Yeah, these fish love to live inside the coral. Oh, and around the coral and use sea anemones as a nice soft bed. <laughs> so cozy. Oh, oh, and look at this one. Oh, it's really bright and green. Whoa, so cool. Hey, remember how we saw that eel hanging out in the rock and the coral? Yeah, they're just hanging out in their homes. <laughs> See you later, enjoy your homes. <laughs> Look over here. Wow, this is a big tank. Whoa, do you see that fish way over there? Whoa, yeah, there's a fish way back there. It's so big. It's a bumblebee grouper. Yeah, and actually they live to be 80 to 100 years old. But this one's only about 10 years old. So it's gonna get way bigger. Whoa, whoa, these are some big fish in here. Whoa, look at these. Hello, hey, and look at the bottom. Whoa, do you see all those? Yeah, they definitely look like sharks, huh? <laughs> Look at them just hanging out out the bottom. Whoa. Whoa. Look at these fish. More big fish. Yeah, these are Paku. Yeah, Pakus to be exact, because there's many of them. Whoa, and they kind of look like really big piranhas. Yeah, and actually, they eat vegetables. They're herbivores. Yeah, you see how big they are? Whoa. And actually, let me show you something right up here. It's really cool. Yeah, here's the teeth. Do you see this? Yeah, they kind of look like human teeth that they have, huh? Whoa! And I have a big treat for us. Yeah, these Pakus, I bet, are very hungry. And we have a nice yummy snack for them. Yeah, these are almonds. Watch out, they might splash. Whoa! Look at them go! Whoa! Whoa! I'm throwing them down so then they hear and see them splash. There we go. Yeah, it's like they're falling off of trees. Whoa! Here you go. Whoa! They must be really hungry. Let me do a few at the same time. Whoa! 
Whoa, don't worry everyone. There's more for everyone. Here you go. Whoa, cool. <laughs> Whoa. All right, here's some more. <laughs> wow. Aren't they cool? They must be very, very hungry. Whoa, cool. <laughs> Wow, wasn't this so much fun learning about marine animals together? Yeah, I had a great time learning with you. <laughs> well, this is the end of this video though. But if you want to watch more of my videos, all you have to do is search for my name. Will you spell my name with me? <laughs> B-L-I-P-P-I, -P -P -I. Lippy. Good job. All right, see you again. <laughs>
it looks like there's some more fish over here. Ooh, maybe this would be a really good place to go fishing. <laughs> Whoa, and check it out. Look, I see someone. <laughs> I bet they could help teach us how to fish. <laughs> Let's go say hi. Oh, hi there. I'm Blippi, what's your name? Hi, I'm Jim. Oh, it's nice to meet you, Jim. <laughs> well, we've been admiring all the beautiful fish and I was hoping to go fishing today. Do you think you could teach me how? I think so. <laughs> okay, great. Well, what's the first thing to be a fisherman? Well, actually, you need some equipment. Oh, um, okay. I just happen to have some here. Whoa. Whoa, this what's is, that? This is, called a, this is called a fishing vest. Whoa, oh, thank you. And it goes on, and they have a little pocket so you can put your your tackle in there. Oh, check it out! My very own fishing vest. <laughs> well, now I really feel like a fisherman. <laughs> <laughs> you look like a fisherman. <laughs> well, what other equipment will we need? Well, we need a fishing pole. Oh, okay. Whoa, and I like this fishing pole because look, it's orange. <laughs> yeah, whoa, that's cool. Yeah, and this is called a spinning reel. Oh, check it out. Yeah. You see this? A spinning reel right there. Whoa, and is this the fishing line? Yeah, that's a fishing line, and it's really almost clear so that doesn't, the fish can't see it. Whoa, that's so, so cool. So we can fool them, and this, is, <laughs> and this is called the lure. Whoa, check it out. Yeah, that lure. Whoa, that looks so cool. And I bet when this is in the water, it looks pretty sparkly. <laughs> it does. It, the little spinner goes around and around, and it flashes in the sun. Whoa! <laughs> I like that. <laughs> and it makes little vibrations in the water, little noises that Whoa. the fish can hear. Yeah, and I bet they like that a lot. They yeah, come swimming over. They do. <laughs> Whoa. Yeah, they do like it. And is this where you hold the fishing rod? Yeah, you hold it with one of your fingers through there. Okay. And then one finger up here that can grab the line. Okay. Just roll that over, and then you push it forward, and when you go forward, you release your release the finger and it okay. lets the line come off the reel. Oh, well, that sounds easy you enough. You can do that? I think so, but I also saw this. <laughs> it's a net. Whoa, <laughs> whoa, ah! oh, uh-oh. <laughs> well, I think this is for the fish, right? Well, yes, actually, <laughs> it's so that we can get them out of the water. That's kind of far down there to get them out of the water. And yeah, sometimes you... you can't just lift them out because they might break the line. Oh yeah, and you don't want to fall in either. <laughs> so you use the net to scoop them up in the water and then you can get them out and take the hook out. Well, maybe you could show me how to cast the line and I can hold the net and help net it out of the water. <laughs> oh, sure, I would like that. Okay, here, I'll hold the net and let's see if we can catch a fish. <laughs> All right, are okay. you ready? Yeah, I'll stand over here. Okay. <laughs> here so, we go. Gonna grab the line, gonna cast. <laughs> Whoa, look at it Whoa. go. Whoa, it's spinning through the water. <gasps> Whoa, looks like the fish are liking it. Whoa. We <laughs> got one. Whoa. That was so go. fast! Oh, whoa. it came unhooked. Oh, whoa, that was close, yeah. Oh, there's another one. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> we got one, yeah! I'm gonna see if I can catch him in my net. Boy, whoa. look at him splashing and jumping. Whoa, yes. here we go. There you go. Good job. Oh, look, oh, we caught a fish. Oh, here we go. Yeah. Wow, that's amazing. It looks like it's a rainbow trout, yeah. Here, I'll let you, you, you want take. You me to take the hook out? Yeah, that'd be great. Okay. Yeah, rainbow trout are really, really colorful fish. Yes. They're all different okay, colors. Okay, like we got the hook Red out. and green. Okay, Whoa. let me get my hands wet. Yeah. <laughs> we don't. Yeah, we want our hands wet if we're gonna touch a fish. <laughs> there we Whoa, go. Oh, look at them. Yeah, look, it's the fish's tail and Whoa, what are those right here? That's called his gill plate. Wow. And it's a male. Whoa, it's so colorful. See, the See red that? gill plate. They get like that in the fall when they're spawning. The males get really colorful. Whoa, <laughs> and look, it has a lot of spots. <laughs> so we're gonna have to get this guy back in the water though. Whoa, Whoa. uh oh, <laughs> whoa, dancing fish. <laughs> get him okay. back in the net. Yeah, there we, we go. better put him back in the water. Okay. Whoa. Here you go. Just watch him swim away here. Oh, here you go. There, he's doing better. Whoa, look Come at him on. go. Aw, <laughs> bye-bye, little fish. <laughs> yeah, those rainbow trout, they really like swimming through the water, and it's important for them to be sent back into the water so that they can breathe through their gills. <laughs> well, I'll see you later, little fishy. <laughs> Whoa, you are really good at catching fish with your fishing rod. <laughs> well, I bet you can do it. Well, you think I could try? Sure. Okay, maybe I'll try this time, and do you think you could help me yes. net it? <laughs> okay, here we go. So the first things first, 
we have to hold it like this. See? Ooh. Is that right, Tim? That's perfect. Oh. And then we want to put our finger on the line and flip this little, hmm, what yeah, do you call that? The bale. The bale. The bale? Whoa, yeah. See the bale? Oh, that silver part. And then, uh-oh. Uh <laughs> we want to cast the line. Here we go. Ready? Whoa, good cast. Whoa, Whoa. that was really far. <laughs> okay, we put the bale down and we start to slowly bring it back. Okay, and now we want the spinner to spin. And this time I'm going to hold it oh, up. Oh, you got him. Whoa. Whoa. There you go. Here we go. All Reel right. him in. Reel him in. Whoa. Boy, he's fighting. Here we go. Oh, he's coming. You got Whoa, him. Oh, yeah. We got him. Whoa. Here, I'll hold the net. <laughs> you could help take out the hook. Okay. Whoa. I caught my very own fish. You did it. Whoa. You did it. Yeah. It's really fun catching the fish. And it's really nice, too, to release them back into the water so they can keep being really swimmy and going really fast. Whoa. That one's so shiny, look. Oh, yeah, Whoa. yeah. <laughs> but this is a female. You notice he's not as red as the other one. Oh yeah, he's kind of yeah. white colored on the yeah, belly. Yeah, kind of white on the belly. Whoa, well, we better put him back. <laughs> bye bye, little fish. <laughs> oh, Jim, I see there's a little waterfall over there. Oh, where does all the water come from? <laughs> well, we have springs in this park. The water comes right up out of the ground. Whoa. And, and bubbles up and it's nice and cold. Whoa, so I bet. The fish love it. <laughs> That's what creates the whole creek is the springs. Wow, it's amazing. And rainbow trout love cold water. So <laughs> that's why they're here. <laughs> well, Jim, I also noticed you had some other fishing rods. Yeah. Right over here. There's one and whoa, two. Yeah. What kind of fishing rods are these? Well, these are called fly rods. Oh, fly rods. And because <laughs> They call the lures flies, okay. and flies are very small, so this is a special rod designed to throw little tiny flies like this. Oh yeah, look, there's a lure right here. Yep. See, it's a teeny tiny little lure, <laughs> just like a little fly buzzing around. <laughs> Whoa, and it looks a little different, right? The, this part right here. The fly reel, that's the reel that holds the line. Yeah, it looks mm -hmm. a little different from that other rod. <laughs> yeah, and the line's different too, it's bright bright green and it's big, it's really Whoa. fat. <laughs> oh yeah, it's a little heavier too. Well, do you think you could show me how to use a fly rod? Sure. Well, first you just unhook it like you did. Okay. And get it unwrapped. There you right go. Right on like that. So, there Whoa. you go. <laughs> it got a little bit wrapped up. <laughs> yeah, it happens. Yeah. Okay. Now, once you get it up like that, you lay, throw the line out in the water a little bit. Okay. Just like that. Okay, here, let and me unwrap it a bit. Yeah, I can help you. Well, thanks, Jim. Yeah. <laughs> there we go. Now, let some line out. Okay. Whoa. There you go. <laughs> Whoa, there we go. <laughs> yeah. Whoa. <laughs> there, once you have some line out, you bring the rod back and you stop it right about here. Okay. And then you roll it back forward like this until the fly goes right in the water like that. Oh, okay. There you go. Here, yep. let's see if we can try. Give and it then a try. Once it goes down, I just reel it back in. You only well, you watch that float and see if it goes under. If the fish take it and grab it, it'll go. It'll go down, and then you then you pull the fish in. Okay, here we go. <laughs> we'll go up and then down. Yep. Oh. That's it. Whoa! That was a little tricky. <laughs> yep. I'll try again. Do it. Try again. Here we go. I'll go up. Yep. There it is. Now just let it sit. Now watch that float. And if you see it go down, that's when you that's when you jerk the fish in. Go, go, go! Whoa, here we go! Pull it up hard! Pull it up hard! Whoa! Whoa! Uh oh! <laughs> he, he got, got away! He got away! <laughs> okay. Try well, it again. Definitely takes a lot of patience doing fishing. <laughs> yeah, a little bit. See if you can do that cast again. Okay, here we go. We'll go up and over. Okay. That's it. Whoa! Whoa! Whoa look at that big one. thing! Whoa! My goodness, that's a big one. Whoa! Check it out! Whoa, this is a really big one. I <laughs> think I better stick with the net. <laughs> <laughs> Whoa, here we go. Here we go. Whoa, look, Jim's reeling him in. Oh, I'm gonna pick up the fish with my net so we can see him. Whoa, oh, this fish is enormous. It's gigantic. It's huge. <laughs> look. Whoa, 
Here you go. Wow, Come I'm on. gonna need a good net, man. Whoa, yeah. Oh, look, he's tangled up in the line. He's coming in, though. You ready? Here you go. That little fish. You got him. Whoa. <laughs> oh, he's heavy. Whoa. He's so heavy. Whoa. Whoa. <laughs> Check it out. Whoa. Wow. Jim, how big is this fish? This fish is about four pounds or Whoa. more. Four pound yeah, fish. Yeah, about That's 23 a big inches. Whoa. 23 wow. inches. Look at him. Whoa, look at the size of this fish. Hi, little guy. <laughs> well, thanks mm -hmm. for coming up here with us. <laughs> Whoa, look better at that. send it back to the water. <laughs> yeah, we better get him back in there. Here we go. There you go. Back into the net. You gonna do it? There and you go. back to the water you go. Ooh, there you go. Just let him breathe a little bit. <laughs> and once he here starts, he goes. starts kicking around, we'll let him go back. Yeah. Just like that. There you go. Perfect. There you go, little fishy. Bye-bye. <laughs> <Aww. laughs> Good job. That, that was awesome. <laughs> yeah, that was the biggest fish ever. <laughs> well, thank you so much for teaching me about fly fishing and using a fishing rod. <laughs> I feel like a real fisherman. Well, I guess what? I have a surprise for you. A surprise for me? Yeah. <gasps> I got this little rod for you to practice with. Whoa, check it out. It's for me, my very own fishing practice rod. <laughs> Whoa, and check it out. It's flippy, <laughs> yeah. Whoa, it's orange and blue. And this is probably a very good rod to practice with because it's safe. It has a bow tie instead of a hook. <laughs> right. <laughs> well, thank you so much, Jim. You're welcome. I'll see you soon. I'll see ya. <laughs> Whoa. <laughs> yeah, that was awesome. I had so much fun finding a creek with some rainbow trout. Yeah meeting Jim and learning how to fish and fly fish and getting my very own Flippy Kid Casters fishing rod. <laughs> well, this isn't a real fishing rod, but it's great for practice. <laughs> yeah, I don't think fish like to eat bow ties. <laughs> okay, I think we're ready for some more practice. I wonder if we'll catch something. Here we go. Woo! <laughs> Whoa, looks like we caught something. I think it's, I think it's, a boot? <laughs> well, let's try again, see if we catch a fish. Here we go. Whoa! <laughs> oh! Whoa! It's... It's... A potato? <laughs> That's pretty silly. But I think this time we're definitely going to catch a fish. Here we go. And... Whoa! <laughs> let's see. <gasps> It's a fish! Yeah! A silly fish! <laughs> well, that's the end of this video, but if you want to watch more of my videos, all you have to do is search for my name. <laughs> hey, can you spell my name with me? Okay, here we go. Ready? B-L-I-P-P-I! -P -P -I. Flippy, good job! <laughs> well, I'll see you soon. I'm gonna keep practicing. Ooh, here we go. <gasps> Wait a minute. I think we got another one! Whoa! Hey! It's me, Flippy! And today, we're here at a very special place! <laughs> Kidzania in London, England! <laughs> yeah! Kidzania is a place where kids ages 4 to 14 can learn what it's like to be a part of a city! <laughs> I think you and I should go to the job center and try out some different jobs. <laughs> but wait a minute, how are we gonna get to Kidzania? Hmm. Whoa, check it out! <laughs> it's an airplane! <laughs> Let's fly to Kidzania. Here we go. <laughs> Whoa, we're here on the plane. And now that we checked in, we need to find our seats. Hmm. Oh, this is mine. <laughs> hmm. Oh, and don't forget to buckle up. <laughs> Safety first. <laughs> I just love being on an airplane. <laughs> Have you ever flown on an airplane before? <laughs> awesome! <laughs> yeah, airplanes can be a lot of fun because they go so many different places and they get there really fast. <laughs> oh. Yeah, when I'm on an airplane, sometimes I like to read a book. <laughs> maybe eat a yummy meal. <laughs> or maybe 
take a nap. <laughs> and we're gonna need a lot of energy at Kidzania doing all these jobs. <laughs> so, I think I'm gonna take a little nap. Like we made it! We're here at Kinzania! <laughs> Time to go! <laughs> Whoa! This place is awesome! <laughs> I'm so excited to be visiting Kinzania! <laughs> and I wonder what jobs we'll get to try. <laughs> Whoa! And look at who it is! It's Urbano! <laughs> oh, hi! Or Kai! <laughs> yeah! Urbano, he lives in Kidzania, and he speaks the Kidzanian language. <laughs> well, Urbano, we were hoping to try some jobs. Where should we go? Oh, over there. The Job Information Center? <laughs> awesome! Oh, thanks! Uh, thanks! <laughs> See you soon! <laughs> Woo! Let's go! <laughs> Whoa, check it out! We're here at the Job Information Center. Yeah, this is where you get to pick what job you're going to try. <laughs> hmm, I wonder what we're gonna do today. Hmm. Whoa, look at what it is. <laughs> it's a Kidzania bank card <laughs> from the Central Bank of Kidzania. <laughs> yeah, and look, this one has my name on it. <laughs> B-L-I-P-P-I, -P -P -I. <laughs> Blippi. <laughs> I need to hang on to this. That's because when you work a job at Kidzania, you get paid. Kidzos! <laughs> That's the money of Kidzania. <laughs> I want to earn a lot of Kidzos today. <laughs> I'm gonna hold on to this for later. <laughs> well, we just need to pick what job we're gonna try. Hmm. Mm. Oh! <laughs> Maybe we can try one of these jobs. We could be a firefighter. Or a shop assistant? Ooh, a pilot? <laughs> Ooh, a radio DJ? Or a cleaner? <laughs> hmm, which one should we pick? Well, everyone's always told me that I have a voice for the radio. <laughs> Welcome to Smooth Jazz with Flippy. <laughs> yeah, I think I want to be a radio DJ. station. That's where we can have our radio show as radio DJs. <laughs> yeah, it can be the Blippi Radio Show <laughs> on 105 point Blippi FM. <laughs> Come on. Whoa, check it out. We made it inside the radio station. And this is the recording booth. Whoa, <laughs> check it out. We have everything we need in order to have an amazing radio DJ show. <laughs> yeah, look, we have a microphone with this big arm. Ooh, 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 ooh. <laughs> yeah, radio DJ needs a microphone so that everyone can hear him. <laughs> Whoa, check it out. We have some headphones. Ooh, and computers. Oh, <laughs> and it looks like. This is the most important thing. It's a mixing board. <laughs> yeah, the mixing board is really important because you might have people call in or guests at other parts of the desk and you want to make sure you can adjust the volume. Yeah, if someone's talking really loudly, <laughs> you can turn them down on the mixing board. Or if they're talking really, really quietly, <laughs> you can turn them up so everyone on the radio can hear them better. <laughs> Whoa. Oh, that reminds me. The mixing board is really important because one of the most important things of having a radio DJ show is music. Yeah. Woo. <laughs> a radio DJ picks all the songs and puts them in the right order. So there is sweet, sweet tunes playing on the radio. <laughs> oh, because we have everything we need, 
let's be radio DJs together. And we can make our very own Radio DJ Blippi Show. <laughs> okay, oh, this is really exciting. <laughs> yeah, we're gonna need to talk about all kinds of things, like weather, maybe some jokes, hmm, and we need to pick the perfect song. <laughs> okay, I think I'm all ready to start. Let's do it. <laughs> And we're live! <laughs> oh, the last thing, when you're hosting a radio show, you need to use your radio voice. <laughs> okay, here we go. Hello, this is 105 FM Radio Station with your very favorite host, <laughs> me, Blippi. <laughs> I mean, me, Blippi. <laughs> First up for today, the weather. <laughs> It looks like it's clear skies all day with the sun outside. A great day to go to the beach. <laughs> and now it's time for a joke. Why did Blippi cross the road? To get to the other slide. <laughs> Good one. <laughs> and lastly, music. We have a very great music suggestion from a caller, a Miss Mika! <laughs> Whoa! Mika suggested the song! <laughs> well, this one's one of my favorites. Here we go! Whoa! <laughs> Check it out! We're here in a TV studio. <laughs> There's a green screen and a really big TV. <laughs> Wait a minute. K, B, C. Hmm. Kidzania Broadcast Company. <laughs> Wait a minute. This isn't a normal TV studio. This is a news broadcast studio. Yeah, it's where they make the news. <laughs> Someone writes down a story, then a news anchor says the story, and they film it so you can watch it on TV. Wait a minute, there are lots of jobs to do here. Maybe we can find a job. <laughs> hmm, well, let's see what there is. Whoa, look at this. <laughs> Check it out. It's the news camera. <laughs> yeah, there's a camera operator that films everything. And this front part is called a teleprompter. A teleprompter has words that go up and down, <laughs> and that's how the news anchor knows what to say when they're saying the news on TV. <laughs> yeah, well, I could be a teleprompter operator, but hmm, that sounds a little hard. <laughs> Whoa, and check it out. This is the set. <laughs> yeah, this is the desk where the news anchor sits. Oh, and look, it's a big picture of London. <laughs> There's the walkie-talkie building and the cheese grater building. Whoa, and look at this. <laughs> it's Tower Bridge. Hello, it's so tiny. <laughs> well, wait a minute. I know the perfect job. I can be on TV as a news anchor <laughs> and read the teleprompter. Okay, oh, here we go. <laughs> Quiet on set, please. You can watch me on the TV over there. <laughs> Welcome to KBC! A fire has broken out at the Flamingo Hotel in Kidzania. Firefighters have been battling the blaze around the clock. The city's emergency services have all been involved. We talked to an eyewitness who saw the incredible escape of an employee from the hotel! Ooh. Pilots take to the skies from the British Airways Academy. In the next five minutes, we'll be taking you through the nation's top news stories. <laughs> yeah! Whoa, we did it! <laughs> that was so much fun being a news anchor. <laughs> oh, and I almost forgot. We earned some more kizos! Woohoo! <laughs> Today was pretty fun. <laughs> yeah, 
we were a radio DJ and a news anchor. Hmm, but I think we have time for one more job. <laughs> hey, check it out. <laughs> it's a music studio. Oh, I bet we could be a mu musician. Oh, <laughs> maybe we can try to play the drums. Yeah, this right here is a drum kit. We have a rock star drumsticks <laughs> and different drums and cymbals. Let's rock! <laughs> pretty fun, but I think I need a little more practice. <laughs> hey, maybe we should find a different instrument to play, <laughs> because maybe instead of sitting down, I can stand up. So while I'm playing my sweet tunes, I can do some dancing. <laughs> oh, look, I think I see one of those instruments over here. Whoa, look at it. <laughs> no way. You have seen an instrument like this before? <laughs> yeah. It's a pretty unusual one. It's called a guitar. Yeah, it's kind of part guitar and part piano or keyboard. <laughs> Key tar. <laughs> Woo! <laughs> yeah, and you play this kind of like you would a guitar. The strap around your neck, <laughs> but instead of strings, <laughs> it has keys. <laughs> Okay, it's time to rock out. <laughs> Here we go. <laughs> Whoa, playing the guitar is so fun and it lets me dance around. <laughs> well, we did another job, which means we earned more kidzos! <laughs> well, looks like we made a lot of kidzos so far. Maybe we should go to the bank and see how much we made. <laughs> Let's go! <laughs> Whoa! That was so much fun trying different jobs and earning a lot of kidzos. <laughs> but now that we've earned them, we don't know what to do with them. Hmm. Ooh. Let's go inside the bank and ask someone who works there what we can do with all of our kidzos. <laughs> Come on. I think I see the bank teller. Come on. Hi, I'm Blippi. What's your name? Hi, Blippi. I'm Esther. Welcome to Central Bank of Kidzania. How may I help you today? Ah, uh, thanks. <laughs> well, we had a lot of fun trying different jobs and earned a lot of kidzos. <laughs> but I don't know what to do with them since we've earned them. Oh, amazing. So we offer a range of services. You could create a bank account uh, or you could spend your money in the department store. Hmm. We could make a bank account and save our money for later or we could spend them at the department store. Hmm. I think we should make a bank account and save them for later. So when we come back, we can get something super big or maybe something really special. <laughs> okay, we'll make a bank account, Esther. So I'll so help you. Right, all done, Belipi. So this is your bank account, and you can spend your money at, on your later visit. Ah, uh, thanks so much, Esther. Bye bye. Bye, Belipi. <laughs> See you. Whoa! Today was so much fun. We got to try being a radio DJ, <laughs> a news anchor, and a rock star musician. <laughs> well, that's the end of this video, and we need to catch our flight back home. <laughs> but. If you want to watch more of my videos, all you have to do is search for my name. <laughs> hey, can you spell my name with me? Okay, ready? B-L-I-P-P-I. Blippi, good job. Well, I'll see you soon. Bye-bye. So much to learn about. It'll make you want to shout Blippi. It's me, Flippy, and today we're here in the Centre du Secours in La Relais, France. <laughs> yeah, and it was raining outside, so I wanted to do something really fun indoors. That's why I'm here at this emergency service center. Yeah, 
this is where firefighters work. Yeah, in France, firefighters are called les pompiers. <laughs> yeah, they fight fires, but they also do all kinds of things. <laughs> and I wanted to know, what does it take to become a real firefighter here in France? <laughs> hmm, but first, let's go explore some emergency service vehicles. Come on. Whoa, check it out. Do you know what this is? Hmm. <laughs> yeah, that's right. It's a fire truck. <laughs> yeah. And in French, you say fire truck like this. Un camion de pompier. Whoa, that's pretty fun to say. And this fire truck is awesome. <laughs> yeah, it's so big and it has all kinds of things to help put out a fire. Like this. Whoa, this is the hose. Whoa, it's pretty cool. And the way you say hose in French is just like this. Un tuyau. <laughs> whoa, and look, it's so big so that the water, whoa, can go through the hose, whoa, to put out the fire. <laughs> and this one is really, really long, see? <laughs> but I think this side goes on fire hydrant. <laughs> whoa, and do you see what I see? One of the most important things, yeah. This is really important, a ladder, <laughs> yeah. A ladder in French is une échelle. <laughs> yeah, ladders are so important so that the firefighters can climb up to really tall buildings and use the hose to put out the fire. <laughs> oh, and check it out. There's a really big door. Hmm. Wonder what's behind it. Whoa, check it out. It's a water pump. The pump puts a lot of pressure on the water so that it can go through the hose and onto the fire. <laughs> Whoa, this is a pretty amazing fire truck. It has hoses, ladders, and a really awesome water pump. <laughs> yeah! Whoa, this fire truck is awesome! <laughs> yeah, it's so much fun to explore it. But remember, always ask permission before you touch something that doesn't belong to you. Good thing I have permission to touch the fire truck. Woohoo! <laughs> and check out all the things on it. Like, whoa, this safety cone. Woo, woo, woo. <laughs> yeah, it's one of my two favorite colors, orange. And it also is really shiny, so you see it. Yeah, if you see a safety cone, it means they're doing something really important. You don't wanna get too close, because it might not be safe. Oh, <laughs> but it sure is pretty to look at. <laughs> yeah, and do you see what else? There's all kinds of tools, different types of equipment that a firefighter might need to help people. <laughs> oh, and look at what it is. Whoa, this fire truck has really big wheels and tires. Yeah, really big treads to grip the ground so it can get really fast to wherever it needs to go. <laughs> <laughs> oh, yeah, and look, it has so many different bolts all around it, so it's nice and secure. <laughs> hey, and you see what this is? Look, whoa, <laughs> this right here is another fire hose, but this one's a little bit different. Mm, yeah, it's really brightly colored, and <laughs> whoa, whoa, you can pick it up. Yeah, you can pick up this hose because yeah, this hose is meant for indoors. It means you can carry it inside a building, put out the fire that's inside. Yeah, oh, and see, it's a little bit smaller too. <laughs> Wait a minute, I have an idea. Let's dance and do the firefighter hose dance. Woohoo! come on. <laughs> Woo. Firefighters are awesome. Yeah, they put out all kinds of fires, even forest fires and wildfires. <laughs> yeah, that's when they use this fire truck here. Whoa, it's huge. Check it out. <laughs> Do you see these wheels and tires? Yeah, 
This is called the CCFM Fire Truck. Woohoo! And these big tires help to grip the mud or the grass or drive over trees that you might find on a forest floor. Whoa! <laughs> Whoa! And you see this over here? Whoa! <laughs> yeah, it's a really big bumper! Woohoo! So if it bumps into a tree or a really big plant, it keeps on going. Doesn't stop these firefighters. <laughs> yeah, they need to stop the fire! Woohoo! <laughs> Whoa! And did you notice something? The back of the fire truck is huge! <laughs> Whoa, yeah, it's really, really big. That's because it's filled up with water. <laughs> if you're putting out a wildfire out in the forest or on a grassy area, it's not near the city, so there aren't fire hydrants. Yeah, you need to bring all the water you'll need to put out the fire. <laughs> That's pretty silly. <laughs> hey, you know that firefighters do other things too? They can even help when there's a flood. Whoa, check this out, <laughs> come on. Whoa, check it out. This isn't a fire truck, but it helps with floods. Yeah, it's a really big engine and a really big pump. Yeah, this pump here pumps all the water out of a flooded area and takes it to the drain in the city. <laughs> Firefighters are so cool, <laughs> yeah. Oh, it would be so cool to be a pompier. Woohoo! Whoa! I'm having so much fun today learning all about les pompiers and emergency vehicles. But I would really like to meet a firefighter. That would be so fun. <laughs> Wait a minute. Do you see there's a person? Oh, I bet they're a pompier. Let's go say hi. Come on. Hi, I'm Blippi. What's your name? Hi, Blippi. I'm Kum. Oh, it's so nice to meet you, Kum. Oh, are you a pompier? Yes. Whoa. Yeah, I noticed your shirt and your jacket. <laughs> this is so cool. <laughs> but what's the first thing you need to do to become a firefighter? You have to take some tests. Whoa. <laughs> that sounds a little bit tricky. But because pompiers are so strong and smart, <laughs> I bet it wasn't too hard. <laughs> oh, well, after you become a pompier, what do you do next? You have to dress like a pompier. Whoa, <laughs> that sounds like a lot of fun. <laughs> Do you think I could dress up just like a pompier? Yes, of course. Whoa, that would be fun. <laughs> and I think I'm ready. <laughs> On y va? That means let's go. Woohoo! <laughs> Whoa, Com, what's this? This is what we wear. Whoa, check it out. <laughs> Actual pompier pants and a jacket. Whoa! So colorful! <laughs> oh, how do you say these things in French? Une veste. Ooh, and? Un pantalon. Whoa! <laughs> okay, do you think I can try them on? Yes, of course. Okay, let's do it. Well, which one do I do first? The pants. Okay, <laughs> here we go. <laughs> okay. Whew. Whoa, look, they even have suspenders. <laughs> That's pretty fun. Okay, one leg. Here we go. And Ooh. two legs. Woo! <laughs> Oh, and now, the suspenders. <laughs> Double suspenders. <Woo! laughs> okay, now, time to put on the jacket. Okay, here we go. Oh, whoa, this is awesome. <laughs> yeah, it's pretty heavy and probably really helpful to protect you, right? Yes. <laughs> well, what do I have to put on next? Up here. Whoa, check it out. Look at this helmet. Whoa, <laughs> what's this called? Un casque. Whoa, un casque. <laughs> well, I like the sound of that. <laughs> well, can I try it on? Of course. Whoa, well, this is gonna be fun to try on, but whew, it looks like there's also a hood. Yeah, because firefighters go into really warm places and need to wear this hood to protect them. But I'm not a real firefighter, so I'm just gonna try this on. <laughs> okay, here we go. <gasps> Whoa! <laughs> Feel like a real pompier now. <laughs> well, I think I'm all done, right? No. Oh, am I forgetting something? Your gloves. Oh, my gloves. <laughs> oh, yeah. Oh, oh. Check it out. Two gloves. Yeah. One, two. <laughs> Whoa, that's pretty cool. <laughs> 
And what are these called in French? Des gants. Whoa. <laughs> okay, time to put them on. Here we go. <laughs> Whoa, check it out. I'm all dressed just like a pompier. <laughs> yeah, I have on my pants, pantalon, my jacket, vest, my helmet, un casque, and my gloves. Des gants. Whoa, that was so much fun, getting dressed up just like a firefighter and learning some French. <laughs> but after you take a test and then dress up, what do you have to do next? You can train yourself. Oh, that sounds like a lot of fun. <laughs> you think I could try some training? Yes, of course. Okay, let's go. Let's go. Follow me. <laughs> Whoa, check it out. We're here on the basket of the fire truck. <laughs> What we do in training is ride the basket. Oh yeah, you definitely want to ride the basket. It's what firefighters use to reach really high buildings. <laughs> yeah, but they have a hose. Since we're practicing, I don't have a hose yet. <laughs> okay, I think I'm ready to go up. <laughs> Are you ready, BP? I'm ready. <laughs> up. Here we go. I had so much fun today. <laughs> Thank you so much, Comb, for teaching me all about being a firefighter. Thank you, Blippi. Mm. <laughs> well, I'll see you soon. It was a pleasure. <laughs> see you soon. See you soon. Whoa, today was awesome. <laughs> yeah, we learned all about emergency vehicles and what it takes to become a pompier. Woohoo! <laughs> Well, that's the end of this video, but if you want to watch more of my videos, all you have to do is search for my name. <laughs> hey, can you spell my name with me? Okay, ready? <laughs> Here we go. B-L-I-P-P-I, -P -P -I. Blippi. Good job. Well, I'll see you soon. Bye-bye. Bye-bye. <laughs> Here we go. Make learning fun, blippy, blippy. So much to learn about, it'll make you wanna shout, blippy.